Hello everyone, it is Derek Brown and I'm here at my sons Matthew and Jacob. Today is a special day as it is my birthday. I am 45 years old. Happy birthday, honey. Thank you. Oh, you want a kiss? So yeah, today we are at the mall because, um, um, yeah. Because why? Well, today we are actually bringing the boys to their first karate class. Really? You signed me up for karate? Yeah, then not this dude, Jacob, too. Yay! So, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, what, honey? Nothing. <laughs> so, yeah, we're going to get them karate suits because they recommend you get some. So, what store should we try? I don't think the toy store would have any. The burger joint. It's the bridal shop. Let's try upstairs at that department store. Okay. Okay. <gasps> There's a ball pit. Okay, boys, you guys can go in. Yay! Yay! Keep all the balls in the ball pit. Yes, ma'am. Should we ask this lady? Like, you don't have the dress? What do you mean you don't have the dress? I come to this mall all the time and more of your regulars. Sorry, ma'am. Ow. I need it. I have gotten married in two weeks. Sorry, ma'am. This mall is ridiculous. Don't shop here. Oh, my God. Excuse me. Yes. Would you like Would you like one of our watches? No. Um, I'm wondering about if you guys sell karate suits for my stepsons Matthew and Jacob. Yes. Um, will they have karate soon? Um, class at two today. So, yeah, at two. Sorry, at four p.m. and not two p.m. And um, we need to get them the karate suits. Unfortunately, we don't sell karate suits here. What? Yeah, sorry, we have a very small selection of children's clothes on that rack. But, oh, it actually does look really picked over. I'm so sorry, ma'am and sir. Ah! Uh, do you know of any other stores that sell them? No, ma'am, I've never, I don't know where to go for karate. Maybe try the, um, um, a different store in the mall? Well, we, we, this is the only store we thought of. Then maybe try the shopping plaza, maybe they might have something. Well, it's over there. The hair salon, the pet store, the grocery store, and the sporting goods store. Maybe the sporting goods store. Yeah. They used to be in the small but Yeah. Okay, come on, kids. We're going. Okay. Hello. Uh, hi, sir. How can I help? Um, do you have any karate suits here since it's the sporting goods store? Karate suits? Yeah, well, karate's a sport, technically. Uh... What do you mean, sir, karate suits? Like, like, you mean the karate outfits? Yeah, that's what we're talking about, buddy. We were just asking if you have any. Oh, um, I don't... Well, as you can see on our small, limited shelves, we don't have the biggest quality and quantity here. We did have more stock when we were in the mall, but we moved out of the mall in 2019. So, I'm not sure... Um, I just started working here. Boss! What? Do we have any karate suits? What? I said, do we have... What? Ah! Uh, come here, please! Oh my god! I'm on my break! Oh man, should we come back at a different time? No, honey, we can't. The boys need their karate suits. Uh, just a moment, please. Boss! Call me, no shouting! Yes! Oh my god. Um, do we have any karate suits? Uh, no, sorry, we, um, sold all of them. So, that voice, I just yell at my, um, worker a lot. Yeah, he yells at me a lot. Don't disclose that! You just did. Well, I am the boss, and you... Ugh. Do you want this job much longer? No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Well, you better w listen! Gee, let's get out of here. Yeah, come on, boys. Thank you. Ah! Come on, boys. Ah! So what are we going to do about karate? Well, I guess we could just go in with um, just your regular stuff on. You don't maybe need karate suits. Okay. Where is this class? Well, they, they move around sometimes at the first classes in your school. School? 
well, you're old school, but yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. Hello, are you new to karate class? Um, yeah, who are you? I am the karate instructor. Welcome to the family class. Where's, where are your karate suits? Um, about that. They're all sold out of them at the sporting goods store. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't need to go to the sporting goods store. You could just go to the, um, you could just buy them online. That's where a lot of my students have bought them, including Julia and Mr. Norbitz, um, Julia's grandma, um, and then this family here. So please take a stand next to them. Okay. I might actually need to sit down. Oh, no, ma'am. No, 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 ma'am. Need to stand. Well, excuse me. You can't tell me what to do. I'm going to sit. No, 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 ma'am. You need to stand. Um, no, I'm sitting. No, ma'am. You need to stand. Look, I am standing. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, walk around. Sorry about the mess. Okay, class is starting in 10 minutes, because it's almost 4 o'clock. 10 minutes, okay. Okay, for those of you that are new today, welcome to karate class. Our session just started up last week, but if you are unable to join us, we meet every Tuesday and Thursday from 4 to 6 p.m. Two hour class? Well, sometimes it's only one hour, sometimes it's only two, but today will only be a one hour class. So yes, our session here runs from September, no, sorry, not September. <laughs> it's February. February 6th, that's today. Oh no, today is, sorry, today's February 7th. So February 7th and 9th is the classes. No class at February, February 8th. And then... It will be going until April, okay? So, until around the second week of April, excuse me. So, if you're going to be away, please let me know in advance because I need to. Now, these are some of the poses and stuff that we will be practicing today in the family class. But I sometimes will take you guys on um, children and adults, since there are four children and five adults. If there are any more children, please come to the karate class. Hold on. Excuse me. I need to go next door for a minute. Excuse me. Yes. Can you put my name on the the quality class on the loudspeaker? Sure. <laughs> Everyone go attending the quality class. Please come now. Quality class. Lower form. Please join now. In classes in session. Thank you. Okay. Okay. So now I have. Um. Yeah. So, y'all, yeah, um, this is the board we will be breaking, as you can see in front of me. But, yeah. So, yeah. Hi. Why are you late? Sorry, my mom and dad. Sis, where are you? Oh. Your mom and dad are not examples. Hi, guys. I'm her sister still. I just changed my looks. Excuse me. To please take a stand over be beside the other families. If you come late two more times, you'll be removed from the course. This isn't a course, lady. Yes, it isn't. It's my karate course. So please, do not be late. And if you are late two more times, I will have to remove you from my class. Classes start at 4 o'clock. Like I was trying to tell you, ma'am, before you rudely interrupted me and my <laughs> sister, we are sorry for being late. It's just our mom had to drop us off and my dad... I don't need to know your reason why. But you see, my grandma, I don't care. Sorry, I do care. But I don't need to know what's happening. So, if you come late twice more, unless it's an emergency, you must let me know ahead of time. You hear that? Ma'am, it is the first class. You can't say that. I can say what I want because I'm the karate instructor. Um, are we allowed to start? In a sack! Okay? In a sack! Gabriella! Oh. Yeah, I will be taking world call in a minute. But yeah. Oh. People come late. Actually, sit down. Daddy! Gabriella! Hello there. 
Why are you late? You must give me a reason. Oh my god. I was at the hair salon, so I was going a new cut, wash, and style, as you can tell. Ma'am, beauty does not matter when you need to self-defend yourself. And no wheelchairs allowed. Hey, that's not nice. Excuse me, my son is here because uh, he... Um, we talked to you in advance. He is the one in a wheelchair and that the doctors and his physical therapist recommend that he goes to karate class to get his leg strength back. Okay, fine. I will let it slide this time. But if you guys are late one more, two more times like I told the other family, you'll be kicked out. Excuse me, you cannot talk to me like that. I do what I want! Gabriella! Ugh. Come sit over here. So, little boy, can you get out of your wheelchair? Yeah. Okay, move it around over there. Okay. Ugh. Okay, thank you. Okay, students and parents. I will be taking world call. So, I will start down here. What are your names? Tyler? Gabriella! You need to stop your screaming! Never, lady! Excuse me! Your name? Travis. And your name? Elizabeth. Okay. Your name? Julia. And Cody. Okay. Your name? Um... My name's Judith. Okay, your name? Sam. Okay, Sam, what's your name? Uh, Scott. Okay, Sam and Scott. And your names? Derek. Your name, ma'am? Um, um, Patty. Okay, Patty. And your names? Matthew. Jacob. Okay. And your names? Luke. Stephanie. And Paige. Okay. Now that we know everyone, my name is Sensei Andrew. Who? Sensei Andre. Andrea. So yeah, I am your karate instructor. As I was trying to tell you guys, here are some pamphlets you may look through, and I already described one of the classes. So first, we're going to do our first task, which is cutting in half. So, each of you will have a chance to come up here and hire this. So this is how you can hire. And yes, that's one way to move the water bottles, and I'll move closer. Oh, no, I have to reset it because it already hired before I could hire it. Ha 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 ha. Hiya. Ooh, didn't that hurt? Not one bit. Okay, I hired it. Now I need one special volunteer. Me! I did not even finish my sentence. One special volunteer to come up and hurry on it for me. I will! Hiya! Gabriella! That's not how you do it. At all. At all. Chill, lady. Excuse me. Do not talk to me that way. I am your sensei, Andrea. Sensei, whatever. Excuse me. Stop. Now, let me fix the board. Okay. How about you, ma'am? And you, Matthew? I actually want a child and a parent this time. So, how about you, Patty? And one of your sons here. Oh, these are my stepsons. How about the naughty one who's standing on the bench? Sorry, we're not standing on benches right now. Okay, sorry. How old is your, your other guy? He's five, six. Well, you're lucky, because if you are five, you cannot join, okay? Okay. Excuse me, you know, do not need to yell at my son. He's only six years old. Well, I make the rules around here. Anyways, now I need. I would like the child, the, no, the parent to send to do a haya move. So this time you can use your feet. Haya. But no, don't do that. Use your arm and quality down. Haya. Mom, ah! you miss. You miss. Oh my gosh, ma'am! Did you hurt anywhere? 
I saw you hit your head. Yeah, I hit my head. But, oh, do it. Honey, do we need to leave karate class early? No. I, oh, oh, I, I feel like I'm gonna be nauseous. Please, the bathroom while I see it. Oh dear, she must have a bad stomach ache. Um, I don't think it's that. <coughs> I better go check on her. Sir, you are not allowed in the female's restroom. And because you are teaching the children that, and it is the school policy. Well, excuse me, I can do what I want. As long as you are in my class, and in this room, in here, you may not, you must, and I mean must, follow all of my rules. Fine, I'll stay. Honey, you okay? Yeah. Now, little boy, you hi it. Okay. hi -ya. Good job. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. Oh. Ma'am, if you are throwing up, you need to leave immediately. We do not allow sick people. I'm not sick with the flu. I'm sick with nothing else. Well, if you're sick, I well. If you're sick, you cannot, and I mean cannot, come to class. Got it? Yeah. Got it? Lady! What? You need to stop your yelling. Little guy, I... And you Now, I apologize to a lot of you if this is your first karate class. Yeah. Will you stop? But, yeah, um, this is not normally how I act. It's just the chaos and craziness today with all of the new students. Now, little girl who actually has a karate uniform. Come on up. Okay. What's your name? Julia, and I'm six. Perfect, Julia. Now, can you hiya? Uh, yeah, hiya. Good job. Thanks. <coughs> hi, Derek. Oh, hi, you do not look well. Oh, sorry, I was throwing up. Um, Sensei Andrea? Yes? I think I'm going to need to sit out the rest of this class. Okay, ma'am. Oh, but ma'am, you're now blocking the students behind you. Well, they can come in front. No! They cannot step on the mat! Well, then we're going to sit down then. Ah, fine! Kids, what are you doing sitting down? Stand up! Stand up! I thought you said no shoes. That too! No shoes and no flip-flops! We're going to do all the basic self-defense stuff now, but we will cover that more later on in our next class on Thursday. Now we're going to go over all the rules and regulations of this class. Rule number one, no flip-flops, no snow. You cannot bring snow into this area. No, um, please wipe your shoes at the front door when you come in. No being late. You must be here at 4 o'clock p.m. Otherwise, you will be late to your karate class. Because 4 o'clock is usually after the school time. Be here on time from wherever you need to be. Oh, oh Derek, I'm not feeling well again. Oh. You need to go to the hospital and the pain isn't stopping. Okay. Okay, well, if you're going to the hospital, be gone. And I'll see you back here on Thursday. Got it? Got it. See you then. And what a good sensei would do is bow. So bow to me. Ah! Okay. Oh! Oh, I can't bow. Oh! Oh, my God, ah! Stop laughing. <coughs> oh, dear. Okay, class. Hello oh, there, I just came from karate class and whoa, ma'am. Oh, what's your name? Patty, how old are you? Um, I'm 40. Okay, Patty, and you're 40. What's wrong? Um, I don't know. I've been feeling really nauseous and, and stuff the last little bit. Why did you go to karate class now if you weren't feeling well? Because that's just what I do. I'm, I'm here to support my family. Okay, Patty, luckily the hospital isn't busy, so you can go on. 
into um, the next room next door to, and they will be giving you an ultrasound, okay? Okay, okay, Patty. Hello, Patty. Um, follow me. Okay, may we come? No, sir. Please wait in the waiting room with your sons. Okay. Okay, Patty. So you've been saying you're not feeling well. You're feeling nauseous and stuff. Is there something wrong with your stomach? I don't know. It's just what I've been feeling. Okay, so we are going to take a little look here. And I will see what I can find. Because from what you're telling me, this could be early signs of pregnancy. What? Yes. Because all women go through this. Okay. Okay, yes. Well, Patty, it looks like you're pregnant. <laughs> what? Oh my god, how can I be pregnant? Well, ma'am, it's just what happens. Um, yeah. Is my pregnancy... Yes, your pregnancy will be a high-risk pregnancy. We do not know the gender yet because you are still earlier along. But, yes. You will be due in um, June or July of this year, okay? Okay. Okay, so we'll give you an exact date closer to the end of the pregnancy. And, yes. Um, and everything you're feeling is just all normal. So, congratulations. Thank you very much. No problem. I wonder where your stepmom is, guys. Yeah. Have a good day. Thank you. Oh, there she comes. Derek. Hi, Patty. I know why I'm feeling nauseous and all that. Well, do you need to stay here? No, 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 I don't. Well, what's wrong? I'm pregnant. What? Yeah, Derek. With our first child. Oh, my gosh. You're pregnant? Yes, and I don't know how because I've never had kids before, and I don't know how it works. I'm so nervous. I'm 40. I'm, it's going to be high risk. Patty, this is amazing. Maybe to you, but not to me. I don't have kids. Wait, you're pregnant? Yeah. <gasps> We're going to be big brothers. Well, I'm going to be a big brother. Yay! But, boys, this is going to be your stepbrother or sister, not your biological brother or sister. Oh, okay. And you won't be living with the baby either, because you guys live with your mom and grandmother. But, yeah. I'm going to call Michelle quick and let her know. Yeah, I think I'd l I would like to go home. Okay, I'll see if she can meet us here and pick up the boys. Okay. So, yes, Linda Erdl's not doing well. <laughs> I mean, not Linda Erdl. Linda McGalbert. <laughs> Excuse me for a sec. Yes, um, see you guys later. Derek? Hello, Michelle. Can you come to the hospital and pick up the kids? Oh my god, is, is someone, are they okay? Yeah, the boys are more than okay. In fact, they're very happy. Um, okay, then why are you guys at the hospital? I'll tell you once you get here, okay? But do you mind please picking up the boys? Um, my future wife that wants to go home. So why can't you just drop them off? Because she wants to go home. Why? Because she does. Just stop asking questions and please come, okay, Michelle? Fine, Derek, but you owe me next time you will be dropping them off. Okay, bye. Bye. Hi, guys. Hey, Michelle. Patty, what is with that look on your face? Well, your sons are gonna be big brothers. <gasps> Oh, man, you're going to be sick. I cannot believe you, Derek. Another woman is pregnant now? Michelle, we've been divorced now. It's okay. In fact, you're going you're gonna to have... No. No, this is just... No. I'm sorry, but you're like 40 and having another kid? Yeah, well, I'll be 41 soon. Oh, my God. Okay, Patty, enough is enough. Um... But, yeah, I need to go home and rest, so thank you for coming to take take the boys. Bye. Come on, honey, let's head out this entrance. So don't go be near a woman that tried to throw up on me. I wasn't trying to throw up on you. But, Derek, why? Why would you do this? Michelle, why are you mad? Well, you got another woman pregnant. Oh, whatever, Michelle. See you boys later. Bye.
You guys have a good first quality class? Yeah. That's good. Now let's go home. Okay. Bye.